if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe now. That way you can stay up to date with all our latest unboxing and review videos. So today is April the 27th, 2024, Saturday evening. We got a few pickups. You already see what they are in the title. But I want to give a shout out to all our day one YouTube subscribers. We started in 2014. It's 2024. Still bringing fire, pepper, flame, unboxings of sneakers, electronics, fragrances, apparel pickups, supplements, jewelry, you name it. It's on the way. Check out the previous videos if you, this is your first time tuning in. And also hit that notification bell. So that way you'll have an alert on your smartphone, your tablet, and also your smart watch. So, as far as sneaker releases, today is Saturday, which is a typical release day, traditionally. Um, and when we say sneaker releases, that means that an athletic shoe or some sort of sneaker, a collaboration between a brand and someone in entertainment or two brands co um, collaborated to bring a new sneaker on a release date or some anticipation of the special shoe. Um, and then you just have your general releases. And like I said, traditionally, it was always Saturdays at 10 a.m. Now you got shot drops, restocks, exclusive accesses throughout the week. So you really need to check out, follow some social media or check out the release calendars on all the top brands such as Nike, um, sneakers, Foot Locker, Finish Line, um, Champs, Hibbets, Dick Sporting Goods, these different sneaker boutiques. So you'll see when these releases will be available. And that's what these videos is going to provide a visual, sometimes even after re the release, just in case the sneaker goes on sale or restock. So you'll have an idea hands on in someone's opinion, such as myself. Post man. And, um, the craftsmanship, the materials, the price, and the overall look, style, and comfort of the shoe. Today's release was the Jordan 1 OG High, an Arsenal Red. Very similar to a Team Red. And it's still available now. It released at 10 o'clock. But most sizes are available to purchase. I think it's going to retail around 190 bucks plus tax, maybe even shipping. And uh, most stores should have these available too. If you wanted a red and white Jordan One OG High, and you just get into into the sneaker game. Um, OG is going to refer to the style, the silhouette of the shoe, not the um, colorway this time, just the height and cut of the high top shoe. Um, the Jordan 1 has similar colors, this OG, but this one is not, but it will hold you over if you're looking for a red and white shoe. It looks clean, I've passed on it. Comment below if you got a W or you picked up the shoe in store. And also, um, some released this today, but it was already previously released. This the Jordan 3 women's Georgia peach colorway and the white and orange so comment below if you pick those up super clean shoe I passed on those as well previous releases for this week included um, the Dunk Low SE Veneer uh, from the Ugly Ducklings pack and I was just nine minutes behind on uh, trying to enter for that shoe so automatic L I had the time written down and just got distracted. And that's how it is on release day on some of these limited releases, meaning limited in stock and size and quantities. Um, and who knows, they may still restock. Um, it's gonna be like the purple colorway, purple and green uh, with the suede new buck materials. So um, yeah, that's how the ball bounces sometimes. You gotta be prepared to get a shot in entering, unless you wanna pay the resale price. Um, you can always check out StockX, Goat, eBay. Uh, you can check out my eBay store, P.O.A.S.T.M.A.N. Also follow me on IG. 
But um, yeah, that's how it bounces sometimes. Um, you can plan and get distracted, or plan, enter, and still catch an L. So comment below if anyone secured those. The exclusive access. Uh, we had a shot drop on the Jordan 4 in the military blue or industrial blue OG colorway um, about a week and a half ago. Check out my quick snippet video of those. But I was able to um, secure a pair through exclusive access, um, which dropped at 1 o'clock. I think it was Thursday, 1 p.m. And it only pertained to Nike customers who called L's or losses, meaning you wasn't able to secure a pair on the Jordan 4 any this year. You was granted exclusive access, which means you still have to enter for your size in a timely manner before the draw is um, up. And it won't be available for everyone, just if you get lucky. You gotta be quick with selecting your pair. And you can always counsel if needed within, I think, 20 or 30 minutes on the um, app. But I entered. Probably about three or four minutes later, I had to find it on the app. I had to scroll through the feed. I saw the notification. Shout out to my friend, the Sneakerholic. Check him out on Instagram. Um, the OG Sneakerholic. Um, let me know the time. And I prefer the nine and a half or size 10. Those are sold out. So I settled for the nine. So I'm going to try again on the official release date, which I think is May the 4th or May the 5th, maybe even the 6th. Um, this week and see if I can get my correct size and that nine will probably be up for grabs they're reselling for 320 or 340 plus tax right now at most boutiques all right so enough with the ramble let's go ahead and get into uh, what you see in the title and it's going to be the Air Jordan 5 model aqua colorway from 2023 and i already know what you're saying you're like p it was dropped last year it's april um well basically i passed on them uh we'll get more into that and how i got this pair but um this is going to be the men's colorway jordan 5 1990 model but a new colorway for 2023 um, so this is not an og colorway that michael jordan the greatest of all time war on, war on court, but they used the silhouette, the Jordan 5, for this retro colorway. So you have the black box, we have the blue, Michael Jordan Jumpman on the lid, uh, US 9.5, our Jordan 5 retro, black, aqua, and taxi, meaning it's going to have a little hit of that yellow for that aqua flavor. Alright, so we're gonna flip the lid. Paper a little torn. And this was a general release in 2023. And this shoe is still available at a lot of retailers, which meaning for retail, I've even seen on sale for 168 bucks at the lowest through Nike. So I basically paid a hundred dollars for these through a friend. Um, shout out to Young Taven. And I passed on this shoe just because um, the timing, it was other releases, it was more important to me. Um, and if I was looking at this from a reseller standpoint, it didn't really have any um, profit value of any profit margin at the time, even though it's a clean shoe and a jet black new buck. Great for nighttime in the spring. The aqua color way dates back to even um, the Jordan 8s and the men's black and aqua, which the color scheme was a little bit different. But the women's Jordan 8 with the straps, check out my video of those. I just posted a pic on Instagram wearing those. Um, they had retro for the second time. And the white, aqua, and yellow colorway. Which is crazy and some hits are broken. But back to this shoe, this is the Jordan 5. With your flat outsole, herringbone traction on the heel. 
and where the ball of your foot is, and that's where you're gonna see the translucent aqua with the Jordan in the midsole and the Jumpman Jordan through the translucent aqua of the upper area. So the arch area is all flat and black. The Jumpman you can see is black. Moving to the midsole, you're gonna have black, the aqua, then the yellow, or what they're calling the taxi, as in taxi yellow, shark teeth. In the midsole with the blue aqua speckles. And on the medial side, you'll see a little hit of the ice right here in the aqua color. And the speckle of the yellow. One thing about the Jordan 5 is they kept a visible air unit which started with the Jordan 3, the Jordan 4, the Jordan 5, and in 1991, the Jordan 6. So, 1990 model, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, who uh, started the series um, decades ago wearing the Jordan 5. So you're inspired by the black new buck, which came from the black metallic great material as far as the smoothness of this new buck it really feels good um, similar to I would probably say the black maybe I don't know more closer I guess to the black on the Oreo fives I would say this is super smooth you're gonna have the um, honeycomb translucent screen or netting on the upper outer and on the medial side which makes the shoe a little bit lighter as well you have the jump man on the back and aqua black flat laces the tongue is going to also have that honeycomb translucent netting clear iced out um, you're going to have the reflective tongue. This is going to be 3M reflective with the Aqua Jumpman. The lace lock is iced out and clear with the blue Aqua on the inside. And the little Jumpman and Icy Ice Ice right there. Right. Behind the tongue is going to be Air Jordan, which was upside down on the Jordan 4, the previous model. And the inside is black with the insole and aqua blue, along with the Jumpman and yellow. So you got subtle hits of this aqua throughout and just a little bit of the yellow. Super clean in person. Um, at one point, it was so many Jordan 5s releasing, um, like as you see, I got the Jordan Green Bean last year with the all reflective 3M upper. And I sort of wanted the burgundy ones. And then um, this year they dropped the Take Flight in green and orange. I sort of wanted those too, but I passed. I was very close to getting the burgundy ones. Um, but yeah, same size. versus battle comment below if you had to choose one i feel like this one matches better especially if you're wearing blue jeans but we'll do the aqua versus the jordan 5 green bean from 2023 versus battle versus battle. Aqua 5, I suggest going true to size, which means your original size. You might could squeeze in a half size or lower if that's all that's available. I see these are at Hibbits online, but all the sizes are finally sold out. Um, 
but if you if you had to pay more than retail, maybe ten or twenty bucks. Um, well, right now they should be at retail or lower. And as far as the comfort level, this is a high top basketball shoe uh, from the '90s. So this was a shoe on the court, but with the technology now, it's not going to feel anything like a modern shoe from at least in the last 10 years. So keep that in mind, this is gonna be strictly for casual wear, um, easy to match up with. Some blues, some blacks, white, black V-necks. If you're a fan of um, the Jacksonville Jaguars, the NFL team, this would match perfectly. Alright, so let's see what else we have. So we got a few pickups from Marshalls. We got Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Ross, discounted brand name apparel, household items as well. Um, a variety of different things. Electronics, personal hygiene, uh, things for your pets items for your pets and toys and stuff like that. Children, toddlers, bathroom, decor, outside, living room, um, at discounted prices, brand names. But we got some clothes. And we'll start with this Nike hat. Black. Great for the spring and summer. It's subtle. Swoosh right here embroidered. White right here with a layer of black on top. Dry fit material. Velcro strap in the back. Vented mini preparation holes throughout for breathability and airflow. You got the swoosh on the back of the cap. $16.99 compared to 24 bucks. Adult unisex golf hat. So if you're a golfer or just need a lightweight cap for vacation, if you have a shaved scalp and you don't want it to get sunburnt or any darker, or protection from the mosquitoes, yeah, it's different. Yeah, there you go. And it was plenty of these available. I think they also had gray and white and like a royal blue or navy blue, I think, and white. Maybe some marshals may have a red and white, I can imagine, or a green and white, but I want a black and white. Matches up with everything. Next. All right. UNC, and this is at a marshals in North Carolina. Unisex, baby blue, the team that Michael Jordan played for with the throwback Rams Tar Heels logo embroidered versus just the UNC logo, baby blue. And there was plenty of these available at this particular store. And you got the adjustable strap with a little Nike swoosh right here on the metal part. Curved bill retail at $25, but we got it for $8. Is that a steal? Of course. Tar Heels, let's go next season. Alright, and last but not least, dry fit t shirt. This is sky blue, $16.99. Solution white. And uh, Nike Swim, dry fit, size large. Retail 42 bucks. Nice, thin, breathable, flexible. 
It's the curves and muscles, it's real good. There's plenty of these available. Also, like most of the um, uh, your primary colors. Such as royal blue, gray, green, black, red. But I already had all those colors, and you would know that if you've been following me on my Marshalls pickups throughout the last few years. And just in case you're having difficulty hearing me um, in these videos, turn the volume up on your device, your TV, um, your laptop, your earbuds. We got a new microphone right here that I'm going to unbox. I had one from J Labs, which worked great at first, but something happened like, where like after five minutes it goes in a mute mode with no volume, and it only does it when it's connected to this phone, which I keep procrastinating. I got a new phone. I don't know if it's the phone or not, um, but I'm running Android, but um, I got a new phone, um, the S24, so I may switch over to it. Also got some new iPhone 15 Pro Maxes, but um, this was on sale, so I'm going to try this one next. The j Labs microphone, it works great on my computer and everything else, but like I said, when I'm recording on my phone, like for some reason after five minutes it goes in mute. Comment below if you have the same issue. Hopefully it's not the same with this, so I'll know that it's my device. So I ordered this from Root.com, which is a company affiliated with Amazon or Amazon company. So we have the bubble wrap for protection. New microphone coming soon. It's going to be the blue ball. Oh, I wish I had a head. Um, this is the snowball. The um, USB Type C. But it has the regular um, micro connection, USB connection. But it's all good. It comes with a little tripod. This is great for um, YouTube videos, um, Zoom meetings, and also podcasts. And if you do have difficulties watching videos, um, as far as the audio, you can use the closed caption as well. Here's the little instructions. This was like $29.99. Tripod. I'm gonna screw this on. Helicopter style. Once again, like, comment, share, subscribe. So we're going to see live if this will actually sound better. So give me a few seconds to connect this and we'll see how it works. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hold on a few seconds. I don't like them snow blocks. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, so... This is basically it. The Aqua Blue Jordan 5 Retro from 2023. This is P. Like, comment, share, subscribe. We got more pickups on the way. We got the official unboxing of the military blue Jordan 4s coming soon this week along with the Samsung Galaxy S9 tablet for 2024 coming this week arriving and we're going to compare it with another tablet or maybe two um, and some more electronics are on the way as well and 
We got some SB Dunk Lows. Comment below if you can guess which ones they are. I'll give you a hint. They're a low tier, um, not a super high crazy premium materials. Um, they released this year. And what else can I say? They're part of a pack, I think, as well. Comment below if you can guess which ones they are. And stay safe, peace and love, stay blessed. Uh, victory, tomorrow's my mother's birthday. Shout out to Patsy, my mother. Everyone give a shout out to my mom. Blessed for 2024 and beyond. And anyone else sharing a birthday in the month of April and leading until May. Watch out for those cicadas. They're coming out the ground soon. Um, as far as movies, maybe checking out this migration animated series, maybe the Bob Marley One Love and uh, the Cleaning Lady series, should be watching it soon, and also something else, oh yeah, the Sonic Knuckles animated series, so, let's go, well, I might get reflected three in his credits. I might get it just right. I was sleeping on them, but now I have. Shout out to Taze and Trey John on the big world type styles.